Tonight at 530, we're putting you on alert after multiple car break ins in Gastonia over the weekend. From Friday night to early this morning, police reporting uh, that at least three instances of this happening right outside restaurants or hotels. Now, police at the moment don't know if there's any connection in all these cases, but they are warning people to at least be aware of their surroundings there. Kendall Morris is following this story. She's got more for us. Police say it takes just a couple of seconds to hit the lock button and make sure your car is secure, keeping you from becoming a victim. Two cars broken into outside this Buffalo Wild Wings, one outside this Logan's Roadhouse, and two outside this Courtyard Marriott, all in less than three days. We have our share of car break-ins, like, like any um, urban area. Gastonia police say Friday night around 9 p.m., items were stolen from two trucks in this parking lot, including a wallet, credit cards, gift cards, a teddy bear, and more. Less than a mile away around 1030 Saturday night, police say two handguns and $100 cash were stolen from a truck. Then early Monday morning, police say a truck and a Jeep fell victim to theft outside this hotel. We can't get this message out enough, you know, to, to be sure and lock your vehicles and put your valuables out of sight in the trunk. Crime mapping shows there have been about 500 incidents of car break-ins in Gastonia in the last year, many happening in public places. They are looking for where the people go, and people like to go shopping, and people like to eat at a restaurant, so those places can be targeted. Police say it's important to take any valuables with you and lock up any firearms in a gun safe in the trunk. Don't put them under the seat. Don't put them in the console. Don't put them in the glove compartment. Police arrested Taheem Furby and Cordell Boyd on charges of breaking into vehicles for the incidents at the Courtyard Marriott, now sending out a warning. You will be arrested. Officers are coming after criminals breaking into cars. A couple of other tips from police. Don't leave loose change, electronic cords, or bags out in your car. They say these only make you an easier target for a break-in. Reporting for WCNC Charlotte, Kendall Morris, back to you.